The UTA men's basketball team had a thrilling game the past Saturday. Reporter Corey Most has the recap. It was military night at the College Park Center on Saturday, and UTA was in the trenches with the Texas State Bobcats. The joint effort of Kevin Hervey and Eric Neal worked as well as peanut butter and jelly, as the two of them combined for more than half of the team's points at the break. Texas State stood their ground, firing from beyond the arc and hitting the target five times. The Mavericks also showed their range, nailing five shots from deep as well, but they were still down by three at the half. Now the Mavericks buried nearly every three from deep, but in the second half, they seemed to drop all their shovels. The Mavericks couldn't buy a bucket after halftime. The crowd and the team finally gained some life after the resuscitation from Herbie's four-point play. Where they eventually nodded up the score at 66. The Bobcats proposed a bill for the game winner, but Kevin Herbie vetoed the shot, sending these rivals into overtime. Extra time had a theme of defense and turnovers for both teams. With the help of two free throws from Kevin Hervey, UTA led by two points with nine seconds left. The Bobcats' last shot didn't even hit the rim, giving the Mavericks a 70 to 68 victory. Kevin Hervey had a career night with 33 points and eight rebounds, which puts him as the all-time leader in UTA history for career rebounds. You know, I got a few lucky chances. I think I got one off a. Of Somewhere a couple people deflected and didn't grab it, and I got to grab it. So, I mean, I'm appreciative of the uh, accomplishment, but you know, my focus is on our next game. Up next will be Louisiana Monroe this Thursday. Corey Mose, UTA News.